Amen. Listen to the book. What advantage then hath the Jew? Come on, son. Or what profit is there of circumcision? Yeah. Much every way, chiefly because that unto them were committed the oracles of God. See, you better watch what you're saying. Who he was talking to it was committed to? Jews. To the Jew first. That's right. I don't know why you folks sit around. Why Paul talking about Jew when you probably be a Christian? Man. He was saying to Gentile, he tried to let them know what advantage they got. Mm. Chiefly because that's where the article would deliver. Yes, right. sir. Chief because our father, the 17th chapter of the book of Genesis, Abraham came right along and he got he received this a circumcision. That's right. That it should be out through our generation. Yes, sir. Why these folks sit around mum and grumming kicking? He was trying to come out and let these folks know that's the one who got the article. Right. Don't you be no fool. Now he gave this to the Jews. Amen. When all Israel got it laid on, it fell right into the hands of the Jews. Jesus could have came out of the tribe of Israel because he wouldn't have been no Jew. Mm -hmm. Isn't that right? Yes, that thing was delivered to the Jews. That's he right. said, oh, that's who the article was delivered unto. Yes, it was given to all Israel, but later y'all separated. These people don't know that. They're so dumb, they don't mm -hmm. even know the difference. Mm -hmm. that's right. You ought to know about it. Mm -hmm. You ought to know where your Lord came from. The 17th chapter the book of the book of Hebrew told you, ever did our Lord spring, spring out, out of, of Judah. Judah. You ought to know there's a reason he put it in there yeah. because those are the Jews. Amen. The Benjamins. The Benjamites, the Judah. And then when they come down to Parsa Levi, these were the Jews. That's right. Everybody else from Israel that got it converted again. That's, That's, right. Right. That's right. Everybody that's saved and born again that you have converted to become a Jew or you're not saved. That's right, yes, sir. Listen to the book. Amen. For what if some did not believe? See, they be quoting Romans 3 and 3. They don't even know what he's talking about they believe. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. I thank the Lord I'm a Christian. You're one of them that don't believe in. Right. He just told you what advantage of the reason you need to know this. Because yes, this is who the article was delivered unto. That's right, yes, sir. You'll be a newborn sucker to sit around and think you ain't got to be no Jew. And the man just told you what if some did not believe. Yes, sir. New Testament right. These dumb folk think scripture. And they still ain't got sense enough to even know what he was talking yes, about. Sir. Amen. But what if some did not believe? Shall their unbelief make the faith of God without effect? God forbid. Yea, let God be true, but every man a liar. How many times y'all heard Romans 3 and 3 read? Mm -hmm. But when you hear 3 and 1, make a whole lot more sense, ain't it? Mm -hmm. Why would you call them a liar about? Amen. If you don't believe the Jews got it. Mm -hmm. If you don't believe the divinely inspired word was given to the Jews. That's the way they advantage He said, chief, chief, mainly because they the one got the articles. Mm -hmm. yes, sir. Mainly because they the one he gave the word to. That's right. Man. That's right. Man, hold you got. How the Father said to be the psalm at verse 17. Let's go to verse 17. Yes, Thank God, amen. We're going to walk the dog with this oh, thing. Amen. Ain't nobody getting by. Yes, sir. I got Bible chapter in verse that ain't nobody else got it. Mm -hmm. Nobody else got it. You got to be a Jew if you say you are a liar and a hypocrite from hell if you're not a Jew and you don't come with the book and you don't believe what the book said. Yeah. Isn't that right? He said the article was delivered unto us, didn't it? What he said? That's right, 147 division of the song. Give me about verse 17. We'll work it down. It don't make no difference. 19 sound in my mind. 17. You know what they say? It's all the same word. Listen to the book. He catches forth his eyes like morsels. Who y'all think that is? Mm -hmm. Man, he shoot that thing out like his food. Listen to the book. Who can stand before his cold? You need to ask yourself, who's gonna stand before his cold? Man, man, a, make a ice, man, make a, a ice cube out of you. <laughs> Come on, son. He's you don't even want nobody his hell, his hell heat. He That's telling right. you about his coal. Mm -hmm. <laughs> tell my man, I'll burn up in hell. You'll freeze to death if he throw his coal on you. Right, right. <laughs> he said, who can stand before his coal? Listen. He sent it out his word. He sent out his word. And melted them. And melted them. He causes his wind to blow. He calls his wind to blow. And the waters to flow. And the water to Then the things just flow. Listen to the book. He showed his word unto Jacob. Y'all hear this? He showed his word unto who? Jacob. And what else he did? His statutes and his judgments unto Israel. Y'all hear that? His stature and his judgment unto who? Yes. Let's see what the book said. Anybody else get it? He has not dealt so with any nation. You think I'm going to believe God got some more people That's outside right. of Israel that he done show his law, his stature? I'm going to believe that God got some Muslims. Mm. He has not that he dealt. showed some law and some stature. And right here, David told me what he did, preacher. He has not dealt so with any nation. They are nation? Yes. And they ain't Israel? I don't believe it's butter. That's right. That's right. I don't believe it. So you understand when Paul would have spoke to these Gentiles who he was sent to in the book of Romans, he would have let them know what advantage of the Jew? 
Simply because they the one article we're given to. That's right. Amen. Simply because he never dealt with nobody. Anybody he dealt with, get over here to conform to. Right to what they had. That's right. That's Come right. on, son, pick me that Galatians chapter 2. I got to make it all fit. Yes, sir. Galatians chapter 2. Two and one first. We got to go to work. Y'all all right tonight? Amen. I was tied up some. They didn't get in the gym, but thank the Lord. Hey, Amen. My red. I tell y'all what, we're working on salvation. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And you can't get it when you don't believe. That's right. Folks, so this ain't important. That's why they ain't saved. That's why they run around calling themselves serving in churches with crosses on them and thicker rings everywhere. That messed up junk. He done told you he ain't got no business with it. That's right. Why you think he let it? He know that. Listen, once you see him with them crosses, them doves, and you see all them praying hands, you already know he ain't never dealt That's with them. That's right. He done told you. Now, right. he showed them their laws and their statutes. He said, I ain't never dealt. I'm going to see somebody else. The Lord appeared to me and gave me a cross and these turtle doves and all. He said, I ain't never dealt with no other nation. Like, That's I right. told you, I already gave you laws and statutes to Amen. show you. That's right. When I spoke to you, you heard a voice. You never seen no shape or no image. Amen. Lest you corrupt yourself. That's right. And they said, I don't see what to do. All of it is about serving Jesus. Now you done lie because he said, you receive and walk in it. That's mm -hmm. right. He ain't never told me about getting no cross and never build no cross. He told me to take on my cross daily and follow him. So if you want to do what he said, where yours at? That's right. Why you ain't dragging no big piece of wood on your back? Amen. Stupid self. No good well ain't what he talking about. That's right. That's right. Tell that lie. Go get that nice little gold little figurine with that little idolatrous man on it. That's right. No good well you ain't obey what he said. That's right. He would have told them to do it. They would have never bought one. That's true. Amen. And stick a fish on your car. Yes. Sitting around dumb self talking about a dun. They ain't nothing but a pigeon. So they got a dun. They don't know the difference from a pigeon from a dun. Man, these folks dumb you done anything to say. It don't matter. It's about Jesus. It's about going to hell because about Jesus, you obey the book. Yes, sir. Because he called you to hold it. He didn't call you to clean it now. That's right. right. Unclean it to do something contrary to what he said. Amen. Listen to the book. Amen. Galatians 2 and 1. What happened? Then 14 years after. P Peter, they were, I paused. They were 14 years later. What you do, Paul, 14 went, years later? I went up again to Jerusalem. I went up again to Jerusalem. With Barnabas. Uh-huh. And took Titus with me also. Yes, sir. And I went up by revelation. Y'all see that the Lord revealed him to go into Jerusalem 14 yes, years later. This man been preaching and going, and man done been preaching to the Gentile. Fourteen years later, this man done went up to Jerusalem. Come on, son. And I went up by revelation yes. and communicated unto them mm -hmm. that gospel which I preach among the Gentiles. Listen to the gospel that I preach among the Gentiles. But privately to them which were of reputation. I got the one now that had the one that the, the <clears> men that <throat> need to be the, the men that was a, a high caliber. I need to talk to these men here, these, these big time wheels right here. Yes, Come on, sir. son. Lest by any means I should run or had run in vain. Yes. But neither Titus, yes. who was with me. Being a what? Being a Greek. I don't know why these folk try to teach these folk no Gentile can't teach no Jews. Mm -hmm. When the Bible done set Titus up as an elder, that's a Jew custom. That's right. Mm -hmm. Isn't that right? And right. Titus was a Greek. Why would he have been a Greek, brother? Because his father, you go to me and Gina, these dumb folk don't, they don't make no difference. I don't know because he eat Greek salad. Exactly. <laughs> going to hell. Exactly. Going to hell. It make a difference. You need to know this. Because you got these ignorant Hebrew Israelites teaching these mm. folk that Gentiles can't be preachers inside of, can't teach mm. among Jews. Mm. Yet Titus was a Greek, which means he was not a Hebrew. Uh -huh. Which means he was not one of the seeds of Israel. Not according to the flesh. Mm -hmm. From his mother's side, but not from his father's side. Right. And you That's went right. with the male genealogy. That's right. Listen to the book. Amen. But neither Titus, who was with me, yeah. being a Greek, was compelled to be circumcised. Yeah. And that because of false brethren, Crap in. unawares, what happened? brought in who came in privately to do what? To spy out our liberty. What you do, Paul? Which we have in Christ yeah. Jesus. Which we have in Christ Jesus. That they might bring us into bondage. Come on, son. To whom we gave place by subjection. Not how long? No, not for any hour. Not for, not for an hour. Not for an hour. Come yes, on. Yes, sir. That the truth of the gospel might continue with you. Yeah. But of these who seem to be somewhat Whatsoever they were. What were they? It maketh no matter to me. Whatever them guys pulled the bed, they ain't made no difference to me. That's yes, right. What happened? God accepted no man's person. He don't respect no man's person. Mm -hmm. Come on, son. For they who seem to be somewhat 
in conference uh -huh. added nothing to me. They add nothing to me. You know what folks say? Mm -hmm. I can get some from anybody. Of course you can't because you're stupid. That's right. That's right. But the apostle said, they ain't nothing to me. That's I right. can't get nothing from everybody. That could right. you ain't got the same spirit. That's yeah. right. He said, we got living in Christ. And the man was living in Christ said, they ain't add nothing to me. Yes, sir. That's why I tell about tomorrow. You know, you listen, anybody get something from them. You can get to hell like that. Mm -hmm. That's right. You can't get nothing when it comes down to God for no anybody. That's foolishness. Y'all hear folks say stupid yep. stuff. Book condemn it every time. That's see, right. that's when you're too technical. No, that's see when you're going to hell and you don't want to repent and you don't want to change your way. You said a lady in the body teacher. You need to make sure it line up with the book. Amen. Yeah. Listen to the book. Amen. But contrary wise, uh -huh. when they saw that the gospel of the uncircumcised, the gospel of the uncircumcised, or the Gentiles, yes, sir, was committed unto me. What happened? As the gospel of the circumcision was unto me. And that would have been the gospel of the who? Jews. Jews. Were committed unto who? Unto Peter. What happened? For he that wrought effectual in Peter. The same one that walked effectual in that worked expect wrought past ten of work. You need to know that. The same one that worked effectually, effectively in Peter. To the apostleship of the circumcision. To the apostleship of the Jew. When you see circumcision <laughs> Jews, mm -hmm. what did he do? The same was mighty in me toward the Gentiles. The same one were working powerfully in me when it came down to the Gentiles. That's right. And what did they do? And when James, and when James, Cephas, and John, uh -huh. who seemed to be pillars, who seemed to be pillars, perceived the grace that was given unto me, yeah. they gave to me and Barnabas uh -huh. the right hands of fellowship, yeah. that we should go unto the heathen, that we should go unto the Gentiles, heathen would be uncultured nations, that we should go unto the heathens, and they unto the circumcision, and they unto the circumcision. Only they would that we should remember the poor. Only that we should remember the poor. Why is this important? And where in the world could we be going? Yes, well, sir. Peter, James, and John had a gospel that was committed to Jews. Now, the same God that committed that to them put the same work in Peter, Paul, who was sent to Gentiles. Mm -hmm. Uncircumcised, uncircumcision, Gentile, heathen. Circumcision, Jews. Pick me up at the 14th verse. Amen. Let's see what the book say. Yes, sir. Let's see if it's still called circumcised. Listen to the book. But when I saw that they walked not uprightly. He said, when I saw they walked not uprightly. According to the truth of the gospel. According to the truth of the gospel. I said unto Peter what, before them all. What did he say? If thou being a Jew. If thou being what? If thou being a Jew. He's, excuse me, I apologize, sir. He messed me up. If thou being a Christian. If thou being a Jew. Now, Peter got the keys from the kingdom. Hold you guys. Pick me in Matthew 16. Hey, hey, something wrong here. Bible throwing me. I'm getting, I apologize. I'm getting thrown off church. 14. Listen, Matthew 16, 15. 14. 14. Listen. And they said, uh -huh. some say that thou art John the they Baptist. They want to know who, the, who said the son of man is. He want to know who the people said the son of man is. He said, some say John the Baptist. Some Elias. Some Elias. And others Jeremiah. Some Jeremiah. Or one of the prophets. Or one of them. He saith unto them. But he said unto them. But whom say ye that I am? He want to know, but who you say I am? And Simon Peter answered and said, yeah. Thou art the Christ. Peter He's, said this, whose name was Cephas. Mm -hmm. Peter, translation of Cephas. Cephas mean literally, brethren, oh, a stone. A stone. And he said unto him, Thou art the Christ. Thou art the Christ. The Son of the living God. Uh-huh. And Jesus answered and said unto him. What did he say? Blessed art thou. Who? Simon Barjona. What did that mean, brother? Simon Barjona. These folks, they don't know what that means. They think that's his daddy name. His daddy name Barjona. <laughs> Where he from? Barbados? Bar means born of. See, these dumb folks don't know what they're doing. He let this man know you knew that I was the son of God. I'm letting you know you the son of Jonah. They wouldn't know this because they preach us on these supernatural trip in a spiritual realm and all time they ain't never done a toilet bowl. That's right. When water shoot around a toilet bowl, like it going somewhere nice till you get down in that hole. Yeah. Look at it, it's like a little pool. Watch, watch when that water, your toilet clean there. You got rain, don't look at it. Watch when that water shoot around that bowl where it shoot. Look like it going somewhere nice. Get down in that hole. That's, That's what I'm right. preaching. It's like they going somewhere nice. They ain't going nowhere. Amen. You're going to be stuck right in the mud. And you know that's not mud, right? <laughs> Remember a fella following him and be playing football? Like, Man, I got this mud. You... That's not no mud. <laughs> you ain't got no... This is this, this mud. No, that's not no mud. 
Listen to the book. Blessed art thou, Simon Barjona. Here. Yes. For flesh and blood have not revealed it unto thee. But my Father, which is in heaven. The Father, which is in heaven, the Spirit did this. And so what you say? And I say also unto thee. That thou art Peter. Called him Cephas. And upon this rock I will build my church. Now this is this why this concern, this this should this should come. This should kind of concern new Christians because now this red writing, this man said he's going to build his church and the uh, gates of hell shall not prevail against it. And what you going to do? And I will give unto thee the keys of the kingdom of heaven. Now he's talking to Cephas. He's going to give Cephas some key to his church. <laughs> and what he can do with these keys? And whatsoever thou shalt bind on earth shall be bound in heaven. And whatsoever thou shalt loose on earth mm -hmm. shall be loosed in heaven. Y'all hear that? Whatever he loose on earth, he gonna loose in heaven. Whatever he bound on earth, he gonna bound in heaven because Peter got these keys to Jesus' church. Mm -hmm. Then charged he his disciples that they should tell no man that he was Jesus the Christ. Back over to what you got at Galatians chapter 2 at verse 14. Yes, sir. When he started talking to Peter, I'm just concerned reading it. It's got to be a reason. Listen to the book. Amen. But when I saw that they walked not uprightly. When he saw that Peter and them didn't walk uprightly according to the truth of the gospel. When it came down to how they dealt with the Gentiles. So here you did to try to teach sin. And man, you know, Peter and them see everybody sitting on. They didn't walk uprightly when it came down to how they dealt with the Gentiles. They cannot mm -hmm. truth of the gospel. Because mm -hmm. mm -hmm. you go back to our law, I clearly law told, if a person straight, they dwell among us, they That's take right. on our behavior. We pull to right. treat them. That's see, they'll right. take, they didn't say that the folk don't commit sin and they done did all these things. It would be wrong. This ain't equivalent to nobody committing no adultery and getting drunk mm -hmm. and molesting no kids. That's right. You know, according to the truth of God, said that, that's, that's not right. Because you know right. what happened? When certain came back from James, you back up a little bit. He said they withdrew themselves Drew from themselves. Them. That's right. They never went to eat with them. Mm -hmm. And yet he told them they dwell among them, so they just like one of y'all. But see, right. we don't know the law. Why right. you don't know? These folks don't know what happened. That's right. Mm -hmm. These folks so ill phone is retarded. Amen. Caught it with Peter. Back up, let's see what happened here. He said, man, back me up. What are you, 14? Back me up about 11 then. Let's see what happened. Yes, sir. So the folks get some understanding see what happened. See what Peter lit a cigarette. <laughs> see what Peter and them bunched on my bill. They were around that chugger looking. <laughs> this 2 and 11. Listen man. to the book. But when Peter was come to Antioch, when Peter would come to Antioch, I withstood him. I withstood him to the face. To the face, because he was to be blamed. He was the one that wronged. For before that certain came from James, he did. He was smoking crack. <laughs> he did eat with the Gentiles. Y'all see what happened? He mm -hmm. was eating with the Gentiles. Let's see what he did wrong. These folks always see, see, he said he would do. He everybody do wrong. See that first he said out he would eat with the Gentile. Mm -hmm. Listen. But when they were come, when they were come, he withdrew and separated himself. Y'all see what happened? He mm -hmm. withdrew and separated himself. Fearing them which were of the circumcision. Why would he have done that? Hold what you got. Give me the 10th chapter of the book of Acts of the Apostles. All it take a little understanding. Mm -hmm. That's right. 10th chapter of the book of um, Acts of the Apostles. What about 10 and about 28? Brother, you're going to give me Matthew 10 and 1. I'm going to clear this up yes, for him. These folks don't know what they're doing. Let's see why Peter would have did what he have done. That's all they got to do is get some teaching. They won't be so messed up. This is the 10th chapter of the book of uh, Acts of the Father. What they want about verse 28 is what I want. Amen. Listen to the book. This is Acts chapter 10, verse 28. Then he's going to give me Matthew 10 and 1. Listen to the book. And he said unto them. And he said unto them. Do you know how? Listen there. You know how? That it is an unlawful thing for a man that is a Jew to keep company or to come unto one of another nation. Why would Peter be saying that? That for Galatia. He told me we're wrong, but Peter said, now you know what the law said now about that now. Yeah. He let Cornelius know when he went down his house now. He said, now you know how it's an unlawful thing for a man that's a Jew now to keep coming with any man that's of another nation. Uh -huh. This is what else he said. Yes, I don't read the rest of it. Come on. But God have shewed me that I should not call any man common or unclean. But Peter still knew their law. God showed him. But did Peter take that to everybody? Mm. He took it to that situation. Uh -huh. He had it because when they came to them Gentiles, he got back from where other Jews came. Mm -hmm. Look what he told me in the 10th chapter of the book of Matthew. Mm -hmm. 10 and 1.
We don't justify wrong. We just make sure you got understanding of why they did what they did. They had law. It ain't lawful for us to be of nobody on another nation. So it won't even come into you. Mm -hmm. This is the 10th uh, chapter of the book of Matthew, 10 and 1. Listen. And when he had called unto him his who? His 12 disciples. What did he do? He gave them power against unclean spirits yeah. to cast them out mm -hmm. and to heal all manner of sickness mm -hmm. and all manner of disease. Yeah. Now the names of the 12 apostles are verse, these. Verse 5. Yes, sir. Listen to the book. These 12... Jesus sent forth. What did Jesus say? And commanded them, saying, Do what? Go not into the way of the Gentiles. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why in the world he to say something like that? <laughs> Go where? Go not into the way of the Gentiles. Now you see why he had so much problem when he had saw the sheep coming down, even with the dietary law. Because mm -hmm. he knew he was taught here as well. Amen. And into what? And in any city? Yes, sir. Of the Samaritans, into what? Into ye not. Where you want me to go? But go rather to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. You Israel? If you're not, I ain't gonna be able to come over there. That's right. Wow. Ain't that right? Samaria was where who dwelt first? Israel. Israel dwelt there first, but Israel was removed out. These people don't know this, but y'all been taught this. Mm -hmm. And Israel dwelt where? In the land of the Medes. Ain't that right? So Israel one now, what reason would he have to go into Samaria? Mm -hmm. Wouldn't have no reason to be in Samaria, That's would he? Right. That's right. No, they looked at Jesus while he was talking to a Samaritan woman. What reason would we have to be there? Ain't no Israelites there. Mm -hmm. What reason would he have to deal with the Gentiles? Because they weren't taught yet and instructed that they're going to have to go and the Gentiles going to have to get this where He was sent to the Jews. That's right. You need to digest that first. Amen. Why you couldn't tell me the first time? Get this right That's first. Right. Amen. That's right. I'm going to tell me all of that one time. You ain't got this right first. That's first, right. they go That's to right. the Jews. Don't That's even right. worry about the Gentiles. That's right, man. Oh, I, let them, I can't take the children bread and give it to dogs. That's I'm right. sent only to the Jews. Right. Man. Come on back over to Galatians chapter 2. 2 and 14. We finish them up. Amen. Y'all all right tonight? Yes, Amen. Sir. That's right. Listen to the book. This is Galatians 2 and 14. Listen. But when I saw that they walked not uprightly according to the truth of the gospel, what happened? I said unto Peter before them all, yeah. if thou being a Jew, if thou being Christian, if thou being a Jew, livest after the man of Gentiles. This is what he said now. If you being a Jew and you live like the Gentiles, he would let him know the behavior you got is the behavior that old people supposed to have. Uh -huh. You a Jew. And this, what did you try to do? Amen. And liveth after the man of Gentiles. Yeah. And not as do the Jews. And not as do the Christians. As not as do the Jews. So he had a question. What's your question, Paul? Why compellest thou the Gentiles to live as do the Jews? Compel the Gentile how to live like a Christian. Hmm. That type. Amen. How you gonna how you explain that? Why would this man, this is when you're really dumb, this man here that we talk about, he talking to, got some keys. <laughs> got some keys from the red That's right man. That's right. That's right. Red right man said he was going to build his rock on this man. That's right. Build his church on the rock. 